Hi guys, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to stop your PS3 from freezing. Now, please note that you do that you follow this video at your own risk, and also I don't actually know. I've just watched a YouTube video, and hopefully, it will work. Now there is one requirement, and that is that you have your USB cable. So, what you want to do, you make sure your PS3 is off, and then you press the power button, press and hold. another beep. Then this third beep should take a bit longer. And then it should automatically turn off. And then you press the power button and wait till you hear a double beep. And then you hear one beep. And then you let go when you hear the double beep and then you should see something appear on your screen and then when your tele does turn on it will say connect your controller with the USB cable and press the PlayStation button and the PlayStation button is the middle button so you press it and you get these six options go down to number four and that's rebuild database and you press X if you rebuild database message place and other saved information will be deleted. I don't think this does delete your game save, but okay. It may take a few hours to rebuild the database, so I'm going to hit yes. And then preparing, and then it should come up saying no signal, no video signal, or no video available, or whatever it easy says. And then it should start to do stuff in a moment. And an available HMI device is detected, do you want to output video using an audio using HMI? Of course I do, because then you get better quality video. And then you want to set that to yes, so it stays like that. The database on, on the system will be rebuilt. Yeah, okay. And then it will rebuild the database. And then your telly will turn back on. And it... And then it's done! You need to press peace. The yes button, and then you can use it. As you can see there. And it didn't take a few hours, it took about 10 seconds. And then it does still have all my game saves there, which is very nice. So, yeah.